we've got two warthog and are feeding on some grass shoots we're right out on Chitwa airstrip at the moment it's nice and open here but watch these warthogs dig and get on their knees trying to get to those juicy shoots and the roots of the grass that's what they mainly enjoy feeding on and using those snouts to dig this was for Taylor's list she was looking for warthogs I think they're wonderful I think they've got such character <laughs> warthogs now Steph had a wonderful bird on the on the river cam and um, the black-headed heron now I saw a black-headed heron in the Kalahari feeding on a snake I know Steph was chatting about um, what they feed on and it managed to catch a horned adder which is quite a quite an unusual little adder very small um, small snake beautiful color and um, this um, it, it, I was quite surprised I, I didn't think I would find a black-headed heron out in the middle of the Kalahari in the desert or semi-arid desert really um, and to see it feeding on a horned adder I've only ever seen a horned adder once before they're very well camouflaged and mainly found up in that area and while this warthog feeds let me show you this picture quickly that I managed to get of that black-headed heron look look at that so that was the the, the black-headed heron in there let me see if I can zoom in a little bit on that horned adder look at that not a, not a, that's quite a large size fairly large size snake but yeah you can see the head so the the this heron very very clever it's got that long beak so the adder was unable to bite and harm the heron but then quickly grabbed the neck and the head of the snake and killed it and then fed on it and swallowed that snake whole it was amazing really a, a unique sighting so just touching on what uh, Steph was talking about the black-headed heron and what it feeds on now a